to get started with the samples for any product, you can just go to the start menu, go to the Infragistics folder, and then choose the product that you want to view the samples for. In this example, we'll go to Windows Forms, I'll jump to Samples, and I'll open up the Samples Browser. The Windows Form Sample Browser is essentially broken up into categories, categories of samples. So you'll see here we have an Outlook bar uh, broken up by categories, and then within each category we have various samples that you can um, double click to open up to see how the interaction works with the sample. So let's go ahead and double click the grid samples. The grid dialog pops up and you can see on the left hand side I have all of the various samples to see how features work with the grid. A lot of them are broken up by uh, volume release. So you'll see here 11.1 was a recent release if I double click word export. Um, there's normally some sort of configuration or property editor that allows me to set properties on the sample and then of course I can execute the sample. So in this case we're really just showing how you can export a grid to Word and I click the button and it dumps it to Word. Now of course this doesn't show any code. Uh, what you can do for code is actually open the solution in Visual Studio for the samples. So this is the Grid Sample Explorer. You can see there's a form for all of the examples that are in the Samples Explorer. So if I go to the sorting, you can see here's the form for sorting. Uh, if I go look at the code for this form, I'll scroll down. Most of these samples, what we're doing is we don't set the property, we actually do the code so you can understand the API and understand the interaction uh, with the control. So in this case, for example, uh, here we have the ultra grid initialize layout. Initialize layout is where you would write code to have sort of global settings on the grid when it loads up. And here we're setting the header click action. So the header click action equals sort multi. And you can play around with this. If I hit the autocomplete, you can see we have some various sorting options. We'll just leave it at sort multi. And if you run this, of course, you'll get the same sample browser that we just opened up um, from the start menu. Infragistics. On the web at infragistics.com.